hey there fellas how's it going i hope you're all doing well are you searching for something futuristic lightweight and customizable because you are sick of the same old desktop environments are you prepared to turn your ubuntu desktop into a stylish modern and incredibly productive workstation the answer is hyperland a dynamic tiling wayland compositor that gives linux an elegant feel you will learn what hyperland is why it's so great and how to install it on ubuntu 24.10 in this video let's begin hyperland is a dynamic tiling wayland compositor that is pleasing to the eye lightweight and extremely configurable hyperland is designed for users that desire complete control over their workflow in contrast to more typical desktop environments like GNOME or KDE, developers, power users and anyone who enjoys fine-tuning their system to perfection are particularly fond of it. The Wayland protocol which Hyperland uses is the Linux display server of the future. Compared to the older X11 system, it is updated, faster and secure. Instead of requiring you to manually resize or drag your windows, Hyperland automatically arranges them in a tile arrangement. It's not just useful though, it's also lovely. Hyperland transforms your desktop into a visual beauty with its integrated support for animation, rounded corner and transparency. Now let's install Hyperland on Ubuntu 24.10. You'll have it up and running in no time if you properly follow these steps. Before we begin, ensure that your system is to date. To download Hyperland installer file, navigate to Ubuntu Hyperland GitHub page and look for Ubuntu 24.10. Clone the Hyperland installer. Move inside the directory and give the installer file execution permission. Execute the installation. This will initiate the installation. Please read the note carefully and input Y. Again, Y. For Bluetooth, yes. Now, stdm as login manager type and because Ubuntu has GDM default manager and it works well. Uh, if you face any difficulty after installation, please read the master tutorial on Hyperland Wiki or comment below. I will try to answer your question. Now sit back and wait while the installer completes the setup process. Reboot the system. When the system is rebooted, select the Hyperland session and log in using your password. Very first thing you should do, uh, check out pre-binding shortcut keys. Press super key and H. Super key is window key on your keyboard. Here you can see list of key bindings. Memorize some of them. It will make easier for you. For example, if you want to close current window, press super key and Q. To open Kitty terminal, press super plus enter. To edit hyperland configuration file, press super plus E. This is a decoration configuration file that allows you to adjust the appearance of the border size and spacing between two windows.
let's adjust the opacity of the inactive window create and save the file let's have a look what difference it makes the border size appears narrower and the inactive windows appears more faded as we modified the opacity and corner size there are other choices for customization read the configuration topic on the hyperland wiki and customize appropriately now this is a user key binder you can edit this file and one can assign your own key bind and there it is hyperland is currently operating on ubuntu 24.10 spend some time examining its features modifying it more and personalizing it hyperland is a powerful tool that can change the way you use linux on your desktop i hope this tutorial helped you get hyperland up and going regardless of your level of linux experience for more linux hints and lessons remember to subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up if you find it useful i appreciate you watching and i hope to see you in the future one ciao